welcome back to my channel if you are new here my name is Ivy I do lifestyle fashion house renovation decor kind of content uh, really anything that piques my interest just a quick disclaimer <laughs> please excuse my leaning tower of an IKEA bookshelf I actually have to install this into the wall so it's just kind of been leaning there so that it doesn't fall but I did put this beautiful orchid so that hopefully you'd be distracted by the flower instead of the bookshelf. Great, so let's get started on the review. So just a little bit of background. I've been a really big fan of APC since I purchased my first bag from them, which was also a Genève bag. Genève? I don't know if I'm saying it right. But anyways, I purchased my first item from them when I was in Paris. I knew that they were really a brand that was known for their clothes and their denim. But when I saw the designs for the different bag styles they had, I just thought, you know, they looked so cool. Definitely not something I had seen in the market. In terms of their bags, they're actually known for their half food bag, which I will insert a picture somewhere here. I think one of the really great things about their bag is they don't sacrifice, you know, quality, functionality, versatility for the sake of the price point. I think their bags are made of such high quality leather, really great finishes without having to break the bank, which if you are a fan of luxury goods or just designer brands, they can get ridiculously expensive and no judgment here, I am also a really huge fan of many designer brands. I enjoy using them, I like the, their quality, but it really does tend to break the bank a bit. Yeah, I think APC does a really good job of maintaining that, that quality. In addition to staying on trend and in terms of their look, they're not so outdated that you might not want them in a couple years or so. So this here is the Geneve bag in the black faux crocodile leather. It is the regular size version. They do come in a mini version. And one of the reasons why I chose this particular style is because of the faux crocodile coating on it. It just makes the material less vulnerable when it comes in this type of leather. So it's not as prone to any scratches, a little bit more wear resistant, which is exactly what I am looking for because I actually have this bag in the smooth leather and that one is very prone to scratches. It actually got scratched up by a dog. so. Yeah, you can definitely see the issues in that one, but this one, you will definitely have no issues seeing any of that sort of wear on the back. It has a good ample amount of space inside. It can carry a lot of things. I just have my wallet, sunglasses, hand sanitizer, of course, and fits a phone well, obviously. But yeah, I really enjoy using this bag on a day-to-day -day basis, and you can wear the bag as a handbag by, you know, actual handles and then you can also wear it as a crossbody. So it, the only issue I've had with this bag is that the hardware is I don't know, cheap looking. It doesn't have the same weight and color you would find in luxury or even mid-luxury purse. This is definitely a great bag. Yeah, I just kind of wish the hardware was a little nicer. I really like the versatility of it. Again, you can wear it multiple ways. I do think the black crocodile leather is a nice touch as opposed to just going for a smooth leather. So I purchased this bag from Essence.com and they are an e-commerce and brick and mortar luxury and streetwear retailer based in Montreal, Canada. So yeah, I had never heard of this site before prior to scouring their website to purchase this bag. Um, how I found them is I was just looking for deals, honestly. This was on sale during the time that I purchased it and I was trying to figure out whether Essence.com was a legitimate website. To be honest, I didn't really find a ton of information on them, but you know, the site looked legit and everything looked like it checked out, so I went ahead and got it and honestly had a really great experience. It was shipped within maybe like a couple of days of me purchasing it and it arrived within maybe one or two weeks so definitely legit totally would recommend packaging was and i know they have seasonal sales so i would try to catch them during those times because wow 
there were a ton, a ton of different luxury, you know, brands and goods that were on sale on their site for a lot, lot cheaper than you would find them. Definitely recommend. I suggest you go ahead and check them out if you're on the hunt for anything specific. So that's pretty much it for my review of this purse. I'm definitely planning on making a more in-depth comparison or compilation of all of the different APC bags that I own that I think will be really helpful if you are considering purchasing one. But overall, I really do think they have a great selection of styles and I think that they're a great investment overall. If you are considering it, I would go for it and hopefully you enjoy your purchase as much as I do. If you guys enjoy my content and want to continue to see more videos like this and support my channel, please definitely hit the subscribe button and the like button. That would really help me out a lot and I'll see you guys again soon. Peace!